so modest is its energy consumption that it requires no more than a year's worth of output from 5 square meters of solar panels harvesting energy beneath far from totally sunny German skies to propel at 6,200 miles. In other words, it's ultra-economical, costing under a pound to travel the 62 miles that also happens to be its nominal range, which is 10% of the cost of running a small hatchback. Although quadricycle rules make no safety stipulations, GM has imposed its own, for side, rear and frontal impact, besides developing a Formula One style occupant restraint system. A single motorcycle style swing arm carries the rear wheels, whose transversely mounted rear disc and caliper break the single speed gearbox's output shaft, ingeniously saving weight. The front suspension is double wishbone. Inside, the cockpit is fully enclosed, but like the Renault Twizy there's no air conditioning, in-cabin cooling achieved by raising the canopy slightly, while seat heaters provide warm. Instrumentation consists of a single screen providing a speedo, eco gauge and battery range indicator, supplemented by a smartphone that provides navigation and the means to control some functions remotely while the car is charging, such as the seat heaters. This car really is excitingly different. Besides the drama, and convenience, of that panoramic screen there's the novelty of the rake's narrowness, a go-kart style pedal pairing so that you left foot brake, a dinky little squared off wheel, a fixed seat and adjustable pedals. And if you're carrying one, a passenger that sits in very close but not in uncomfortable proximity. Go, you merely toggle the prototype rocker switch gear selector hidden close to your right shin, prep the accelerator and grind off. Grind? Yes, because this is a prototype, and makes appropriately experimental noises. It also goes quite slowly and steers rather lazily given its low weight, but neither of these characteristics is remotely representative of how the real thing would drive. But what this concept does hint at, even when driving it in a very large room, is just how much fun it would be to thread through.